All right, now let me walk you through on how to identify that same cable number whenever you come across a different digital control panel that is out of this thread method that I showed you. All right, I forwarded the three different control panel that are most common and that are standard. So if you come across any other digital control panel, that is out of this three sample I sent to you. Use the diagram, demand for the manual of the gen set, then go through the manual and identify the following one remote start, two customer start signal, and the auto start. Some companies use remote start, some use customer start signal, some use auto start. Okay. Then some people, some of them too, use customer start signal and the remote start. Remote start is the common, most popular among them. Okay. Then if you find customer start signal, simply means that the customer has a remote uh, enable device that have to link to the gen set. The remote start is coming out from the gen set. So look for these three names. You must find them. If you can't find this, if you can't find, if you can't find one, you find two or you find three. Any of them, the three of them must appear in the drawing. So that is where you find your remote start. So remember the names. Let's go through. Um, I'm going to pretend I don't know the area where I can find it. So we're going to find it together. Let me uh, zoom this place. Let me zoom here. So that I can find the point together. This is the diagram. We are going to look for it. This name is not the name we are looking for. Just keep searching. Go this way. Here is different thing. Keep searching. Okay, let's come here. Here say magnetic pickup. Let's keep searching. I told you I want to pretend I don't know this interface model. I'm looking for a cable number of 24. I'm looking for where it is written those three names. If I can't find it, I start looking on the cable numbers. These are different names. So let's go up. Okay. Now, here is a crank, engine crank relay. Fuel control relay. This one is thermostat. Thermostat relay. Audible alarm relay. Common alarm relay. Gen set running. These are relay. Let's continue looking for that auto start. I come here. This one say emergency stop. This one say remote start. I find it now. This one say remote start. Check the cable. Cable 24. Now trace cable 24. Let's see where it will land. Remember, this area is inside the control panel, inside the electronics component. So trace this cable. Let's see where it will land. Look at the cable land here. See customer start signal. Look at it here. Look at the cable, cable 24. Look at this other cable, cable 5. So we're looking for cable 24 and cable 5. Okay, so now there's a good news. You cannot just tap the cable here and tap the cable here. You cannot tap it here and tap it here. There is a provision called a connector they will make available for you. So when you go to the panel, you are going to see a ray connector. They will terminate this and terminate this for you. In their own case, they use a terminal of one and a terminal of two. To put the cable 24 and cable 5. Okay, supposing they didn't drop it out for you. Pay attention, please. Supposing you find it here, but they can't find a connector or a breaker where the provision is being made for remote enable. What would you do? You don't have any uh, fear or don't be scared. See what you need to do. Locate the cable because it must end somewhere. That is why the put this this mark show that there is a point a termination point that you're going to be provided supposing they just leave it here and you have this cable 5 
and 24. Just take a loop. Take a loop here. Take a loop here and continue where you are going to. Like I told you, cable 5 is negative. So let's find out if cable 5 is actually a negative cable. Let's look at it. Trace cable 5. Look at cable 5. Let's see if it will land on battery. Look at it, cable 5. Look for it. Look at it. It's coming for key starter. Look at it. Look at it. It's coming for key starter. Look at cable 5. Okay. Come to ground. Look at ground here. Look at ground. Sign of ground. That's negative. Look at it. Pass this way. So 5. Anywhere I see 5. Look at it here. Anywhere I see 5 is negative. It landed here. And here is our interface model. It's an interface model. This is where miniature uh, load carrying relays are being terminated. All the load carrying relays within the panel, they move from here. They generate this interface relay to reduce the load on that panel. That panel don't need to carry too much load. So they interface that relay there. Alright, so this is how to find your remote start in another generator. But for FG we seen that control panel, just go to the panel, go to the uh, breaker position. They will provide it there for you. Okay? All right. Thank you.